everyone. Ooh. All right, so we start off every one of our events with trivia. And with trivia, you win really awesome prizes. Today, we win t-shirts and wine bottles. Now, the wine bottles, in order to win, um, we sim you simply drop your business card in this basket. Please pass it around. And if you don't have a business card, then just find a piece of paper and start writing one up. Feel free to use the back of your food plate or something. Just write it up. We will be giving away these two fine bottles of wine at the end of today. So someone is walking out with them. Um, they look fancy. I don't know what they are, but whatever. Uh, in the meantime, the shirts uh, will be given away right now. Not just those three. I have a whole pile of them, so lots of people will win. So the way it works is I ask random questions about technology. You give me random answers back that I like, right or wrong, and you win a shirt. Simple as that. There are no rules. Feel free to cheat. And if I like your answer, you get a prize. It's nothing to do with being right or wrong. So let's just get some prizes out here. Oh, wait, wait, first question of the evening, hold up. The answer is database? Yeah. <laughs> it would be a need for effort, but you're too early. The first question is who wants stickers? <laughs> All right, so I got smaller stickers that I'm not going to do that to. So just hand these out, please. Not out, but pass them back. <laughs> I, I got it by a show of hands here. We have we're doing a survey. There's two there's two options here. Who prefers coffee over beer? Alright, so these get you guys get the no code for coffee? And for all the other people, beer? Yeah. yeah. So you got beer stickers. No, take the, take the whole thing and just pass it back. Here's some beer stickers. Yeah. So, for the very first question of the evening, and remember, I don't care if the answer is right or wrong, I just want to hear something that makes me smile and you win a shirt. Like, what was your answer before? Database. Who said database? <laughs> sure. Hand, I, I got lights on me. See, you won. It's just that simple. All right, so the very first question is, the OSGI modular Java platform specification inspired which hyperscale digital asset platform that this guy happens to be CTO of? Lucio. Thank you. Oh, that's a real bad shot. <laughs> what does the name Nuxio mean? I want a shirt. I want a shirt is the right word. Who said that? <laughs> All right, what else does Lucio mean? Guys, guess. I'm giving him out for I want a shirt. What? New sequel. New sequel is wrong. Yes, sequel. Yes, sequel is also wrong. Mexico is really wrong. Who ever said that? Just on the honor system. All right, so if everyone hasn't figured it out yet, um, anyone want to do one last guess? Super scalable. E for effort, that's a good answer. It's not right. <laughs> anyone want to try to get into a trick question? No. no. Nothing, who said nothing? That's the correct answer. No one really seems to know the meaning of it. Hyper scale digital asset plug. What's the difference between the enterprise and community versions of Nuxio? There's only one difference. Purple. Money. Purple is a good money. answer, we're wrong. Money. No, it's a real answer, this one is. Support. Money. Support is wrong, money is wrong. Oh wait, kind of money is sort of right. Well, you e for effort. Thank you. <laughs> what though, there's a better answer though. It stands for OSS. Open. Source. Open source. Now you got one, so you just take a throw, no, not at me. <laughs> throw it back behind you, someone else can, let someone else catch it. Just throw it, throw it. Right over your head. All right, fair enough. Nuxio source code is available on which hub? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know who to give it to, yeah. so just, here we go. Thank you. Uh, do you have a lot left? Okay, good. This is, 
All right, guys, this is time for kindergarten counting skills. It's a number. As of this week, how many public repositories are hosted in the Nuxi organiza organization's good, uh, GitHub? Less than a million, more than five. Thirteen. More than four, more, uh, less than 400. 3.14. 3.14 pi, pi. no. <laughs> or it's higher than, than 200. 350 is close to 375. 337 is somewhere like that. What? 342. 337. It's right here for a sorry. You said it really? Alright, here you go. Okay. Um, let's try this is a real question. Then Nuxio can store binaries, uh, binary objects into which kind of file systems? And there is six correct answers. What? 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 I just can't follow you all, but I think you're all saying the right answers. It's file systems, storage systems. Start with cloud ones. S3 is the first one. MongoDB's file system is called what? GridFS. There you go. GridFS is one. How about your local computer? Yeah, it's lo whatever, local file system. That's whatever, that one's a giveaway. Um, there's one by Google, Microsoft, two other companies. The Google one is Google Drive. That's the hint. And the other three are one drive is the Microsoft one. And up, Dropbox is the other one. And then there's one that's half of a Dropbox. Box. Box. Who said box? <laughs> All right, enough for the real questions. Let's do fun questions. All right, Nuxio's got five locations around the world. Two are in United States. France. France is not United States. New York is right. Who said that? And now the other location is in California. It's not the two I heard in San Francisco. It's named after cat and kittens. Anyone speak Spanish is named after cats. Los gatos. Who said that? <laughs> All right. Four locations in Europe. London. London is. Is it London? I just have UK. Could be. <laughs> Who said London? You got one? Oh, sorry about that. All right. Paris is. Germany. Yeah. Berlin. I don't have the details yet. I got countries, guys. Whoever said Paris? All right, you get the, did you get Ireland. one of the throwbacks? Berlin. 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 Denmark. Ireland. <laughs> Norway, Denmark. All right, I have countries. In Berlin, I have, that's the right country. Yeah. Berlin, who said Berlin? All right. Okay, I'll go one. Go. Go for it. There you go. And then one more country. Portugal. Who said Portugal? <laughs> How'd you guess Portugal? I would've, that would've taken me a, like, a lot of tries. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, all right, so when the next question has one, two, three, five correct answers, three are very easy and two are not so easy. Nuxio's platform is built in which languages? Java is one. I heard it from this corner there. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Not PHP, not Node.js, but it starts with Java. That was good. script it is. Uh, anything like resembling a snake? Python. Python. Uh, two harder languages, both made by Google. Go. Go. Go is one of them. Dart? Dart is right. Who said that? I didn't think anyone would get that. <laughs> nobody uses Dart. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Alright, so here's what happens. I am out of questions and I've got one shirt. Who wants it? Your hand went up first. <laughs> and he stole it from you. <laughs> 